After being a fixture in this far north side neighborhood for over 50 years, Chicago's oldest head shop is calling it quits. Known for its embrace of the hippie culture, Adam's Apple will close its doors for good next month. Oh, I appreciate the call. Adam's Apple first opened its doors in 1969 after a now 75 year old Miller and an ex partner took over the struggling business from a couple selling copies of eight tracks along with pipes and rolling paper out of the storefront. Early on, the head shop, which only sells cannabis lifestyle accessories, but not marijuana itself, became known for offering paraphernalia of the pot culture. When I heard that they were closing after all these years, I said, I have to go there. But after Miller, a Navy vet, began advertising on the iconic WLS radio station, which at the time played rock music, Adam's Apple became a destination for young people of the counterculture. It was just, it was a destination to come and things built from there. Adam's Apple had its challenges too. Still, Miller says it survived, only to be done in by a shrinking customer base. There's all these other quote unquote smoke shops, vape shops all over everywhere. Also, the head shop was never able to cash in on the legalization of cannabis. Sales for recreational weed in Illinois reached nearly $1.4 billion in 2021. Sheldon Miller says he'll retire February 14th, the day before his business license expires, really not knowing exactly what's next. Not going to relocate. You know, Chicago is my home. I might become a snowbird, but uh, I'm hanging out. Reporting from Chicago's West Ridge neighborhood, Evelyn Holmes, ABC7 Eyewitness News. Hey, if you like that video, be sure to subscribe to our ABC7 Chicago YouTube channel.